Oh, that was Tinga. Oh no, it's a dra, dra, quack. A duck? It's nice to meet you. My name is Willie the Duck. Have you seen a magic wand? Does it look like that stick over there? Yes, that's it. I need that stick. No can do. I'm Master Soothsay's guard duck. I can't let any of this stuff out of my sight without his permission. You don't look like a duck. I look like a duck. And I talk like a duck. So I must be a duck. No, I'm pretty sure you're a dragon. Say, you're right. I'm a dragon! I told you so. And dragons don't eat breadcrumbs. They eat snarfs! <laughs> Oops! And I like my sauce extra crispy! Hearing the truth has broken the magical enchantment on Willy. Ducks don't eat snarfs, but dragons do. Whoa! That was tingly! Oh no! It's a dra, dra, quack! A duck? It's nice to meet you! My name is Willie the Duck! Ducks belong in a pond, not a treasure room. That's not what Mr. Soothay says! Soothay's? Isn't he the evil magician that owns this castle? He's not evil! He feeds me! Will he be along soon? I hope so. I'm starving. Have you seen a magic wand? Does it look like that stick over there? Yes, that's it. I need that stick. No can do. I'm Master Soothsay's guard duck. I can't let any of this stuff out of my sight without his permission. Halt! Who goes there? Uh, a friend? You don't look like one of my friends. How do you expect to make friends if you won't give a star for chance? Alright, you may pass, friend. I'm looking for something to feed that dragon. Shh! If he hears you say dragon, it will break Master Soothase's enchantment and he'll kill us all. Whoa, that seems dangerous. Not as dangerous as an unenchanted dragon. What do you want to know? Because my boss, Master Soothase, owner of this castle, told me to ask. Well, Master Soothase told me not to tell you who I am. Oh, okay then. Have a good day. Since we are now friends, if you see that skeleton down the hall, tell him I have a bone to pick with him. These, we These weapons might kill a duck, not a dragon. You there! Test this soup! Does it need some more pepper? <coughs> I think you need to sprinkle some more soup into that pepper! <laughs> you're such a joker! You mean it's too watery, don't you? <coughs> Maybe you're right. I could use some of the bread in the cellar to sop up the extra soup. Made. I need more clean rags. I have taken a dirty rag. <coughs> There's too much pepper in the air. If you think it smells in here, perhaps you should cover your nose with a clean rag.
How strange! Where I come from, no one reads books in the hall. A map without an X is as useful as a sword without a blade. No unicorn lady. Sure you are. Look at those horns on your head. <laughs> My hat has two horns, not one. Two horns? Then you must be an extra special unicorn. What's wrong with you? Did you know that laundry soap contains lye? It's a corrosive that can damage the eyes. <laughs> you shouldn't get soap in your eyes. <laughs> That's easy for you to say. <laughs> Unicorns don't have any clothes to wash. <laughs> Unicorn? Where? <gasps> and it talks. Lucky day. Who? Me? Of course you. I don't see any other unicorns in here. Your nuts. Would you mind cleaning this rag for me? Anything for my favorite unicorn. <laughs> I have taken a clean rag. If I tied that washboard to my abdomen, I'd have a washboard on my stomach. Who would want that? Very quiet. So hungry. Tasty bones. What terrible handwriting! I wish there was something to let people write and send mail without all that messy ink and stamps. We should call it snarf mail. Let's see. The big hand is on the I I, and the little hand is on the. Hey, these are made out of foam. <laughs> Yummy! I can do with some good eats. Who needs books? They're no good in a fight. You can't even eat them. Wait, this book looks cool. The complete works of Larry Elmore. Wow, a secret door. I wonder if it has treasure in it. Somebody's having a ball with the world. A starf could live in a closet this big. Who would keep a skeleton in their closet? Why don't you take a picture? It'll last longer. said that? Don't ask me. I'm just a talking skeleton. <laughs> hey, you said that! My skull is empty, and I'm still smarter than you. Sorry, I didn't mean to stare. What? You never seen a talking skeleton before? Well, no. Matt figures. 
It must be hard to see anything over that giant nose of yours. You sure got a stick up your butt. I'd like to see you hang around all day. For a talking skeleton, you don't have much of a funny bone. You make a good point for a talking pig. I know what will shut you up. I have taken a bone. These windows are filthy. I can't see anything. Dragon Magazine? Who wants to read about dragons before bed? Bottles, bottles everywhere, and not a drop to drink. This bucket of water would be a great place to keep an alarm quack. The pepper in the kitchen room won't bother me if I cover my face with this clean rag. Look at the size of that ham! It could feed my whole family! Farf, Swarf, Barf, and Mama Bertha! How rude! I don't put my hands on your food, do I? Here's a bone. Good doggy. This bread is stale. Only a bird brain will eat this. I have taken the basket of bread. Hey, Willie, here's some bread, buddy. Uh, bread! Dum dum! 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 So much bread! I'm so happy! Dum dum! I'm gonna eat all the bread off the ground! Dum dum! Thank you for helping Snarf find the wand, but his princess is in another castle. 
Won't you come back for more adventures when Snarf Quest Tales debuts in 2015? Keep an eye on snarfquesttales.com for game details and development progress. We hope to see you again soon.